Hey, I'm Steve, and I went around to ask people where they think that all of their water comes from. And I'm Adriana, and I went around asking people what they could do with their poop. Okay, and where, do, where in Iowa City, where do you think our drinking water comes from? Drinking water comes from the faucet. The Mississippi. Uh, mostly bottled water, or bottles of water. Um, Lake McBride. Uh, before the faucet, it comes from the river. Awesome. Thanks. Yeah, Steve, thanks. <laughs> so, um, what, what's a way that you think you could recycle poop? I think you can recycle poop by fertilizing it. Um, and you can also use it for alternative fuel. <laughs> fertilizer. You can use your poop as fertilizer. What makes our latrine unique is that it composts to create fertilizer. Uh, human waste is a really great resource of nitrogen and phosphorus, which uh, these families can spread onto their family gardens. Uh, it will increase yields, and these yields are really important in places in the developing world because the people's livelihoods depend on a good crop harvest. Okay. One thing that our latrine has to offer is a rainwater catchment system. Our system catches water that is collected from the roof of our latrine and it filters it down to a tank below in which users of the latrine can wash their hands with afterwards. This allows other water sources that may be more scarce to be devoted simply to drinking and cooking. Our latrine also uses solar disinfection which means you can take water from any kind of source, put it in a clear plastic bottle, up on the roof for two days, and that's all it takes to use solar radiation to kill all the pathogens. And it's safe to use for hand washing. And then you can also do the same thing with urine, and then use that to fertilize your crops. And all that is for free. Okay, so one benefit of our project is how we're going to finance it. And so what we're going to do is identify one family within the community that's going to be given a micro loan. And then over time, they'll be able to pay back that loan um, by collecting user fees and also by creating compost that can be put on their fields. Another feature of our toilet is a passive solar radiation composting system. What it's going to do is speed up the composting process while also creating a safer and more sanitary system to help prevent sickness and disease. For the construction aspect of the latrine, we're going to be using a technique called ferro cementing to do the walls. As a result, this will drop down the cost for our total building process. We will also be using ferro cementing to do a tank, because that would be another large lump sum of money. And for our base, we'll be using cinder blocks to do the composting selection, composting section with a concrete slab on top of it. Thanks for hearing our presentation. I hope that you thought some of our ideas were good ones. Now if you excuse me, I actually need to use the bathroom myself. See you later.